Okay, so tapos na tayo sa definition. So, yun lang naman yung kailangan yung define pagdating po dito sa building. Okay, so review na lang po yung, yung wind definitions. Kasi ma ma madali lang yan. Kaya lang, syempre, sis pa ulit-ulit, baka may nal nal nalito lang tayo. So review na lang po. Okay, so load cases na tayo, define natin. Kanina sa trust, apat lang yung load cases. Pero pagdating nyo dito sa building, meron kayong 15 load cases. Okay, so start natin. Load cases details, add tayo. Okay, so load case number one. Ah, by the way, since kompleto tong structure natin, building structure, meron tong seismic. Requirement case na add pro na pag meron kayong seismic load, kailangan mauna nyo siyang i-define before yung other loadings. Requirement lang naman yung case na add, pero kung mag-manual kayo, okay, bahala kung gusto nyo unahin. Case na add pro lang yun. Okay, so unahin natin yung seismic. Um, yung seismic natin, kanina po hindi natin chinect yung accidental torsion. So, ibig sabihin, i-detail natin yan dito. So, meron tayong 8 load cases for seismic. Okay, so yung una. Okay, later siya. Okay, so seismic along positive x with positive eccentricity. Loading type natin, seismic. So, ibig sabihin po niyan, papuntang positive x yung seismic, tapos positive yung twisting ng building. Yun yung load number one. Okay? So, pakayaan. And then number two, seismic along positive x, pero negative yung twisting, minus e. And then number three, seismic along negative x, then positive yung twisting, and then number 4, seismic along negative x, then negative yung twisting. Yung minus E. Okay, so na nakuha nyo po yung format. So positive, 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 negative, negative, positive, negative, negative. So gawa kayo, gawa kayo ulit ng another 4 along Z naman. So ganyan nyo lang siyang Z, number 5. Six minus e. Number seven. Number eight. Negative. Negative. Okay. Skip. Put the line. Um, number 9, dead load. Number 9, dead load. Loading type, pakicorrect po. Ayusin nyo po, gawin nyo siyang dead. Okay, kanina mas, pero dito dead na yung gagawin nyo. Then number 10, live load. Loading type, live, hindi tayo mag-reduce. So, huwag nyo i-check yun. Yung dead load, hindi. Ang large yun. So number 10 dive. Okay, so number 11 So since building to Meron tayong roof live load Then roof live yung type na Okay, add Okay, so yung number 12 to 15 Option na lang yun Kung hindi kayo magkakonsider ng wind load Siyempre, hanggang number 11 lang kayo Okay, pero naglagay tayo ng wind Nagawa tayo ng number 12 Wind load along positive x. Wind yung type natin. Add. And then, number 13, wind load along negative x. Number 14, wind load along positive z. And then, last one, along negative z. Okay, so total of 15 load cases. 